Welcome back. We are here now on part four of Uncharted Four on PS Five, and it's the uh, thief, a uh, thief's end. There we go. Bitch, Sully, we're stealing. Remember? What if he calls my bluff? He won't. We have ninety thousand. Do I hear any more bids? Guys, if we do not get this cross, I am as good as dead. Yeah. Well, I end up with the highest bid. We're all dead. Sully, I need you to buy me more time. Trust me. Going once, going twice. Scott. Then may we have 100,000 euros in the room. Thank you. Do we have any other bids? We now have 110,000 euros in the room. For a penny and for a pound. That bid brings Don't us worry. to 120. We'll be out of there in no time. I better be. Okay. Just gotta smash the lock. Now the bid has what? <sighs> nope. We are now at 140. Nothing. Damn it. Your bid, senore, takes us all the way to the Gotta be something. Come on. Hey, man, uh, we're starting to sweat bullets here. Yeah, give me a sec. The bidding stands at 160,000 euros in the room. Yes. Senore's bid makes 170,000. We are now at 180,000 euros in the room. <laughs> Gotcha. All right, boys, I'm at the switch. You ready? As I'll ever be, Victor. Just a sec. The gentleman's bid: two hundred thousand euros. Five hundred thousand. Let's get the show on the road here. Uh, thank you. We have five hundred thousand euros in the room. Does the gentleman wish to bid again? Had me worried there for a minute, Victor. Thought I might have to kill you. <laughs> okay, let's ruin this asshole's evening. Anyone else? We are going once. Going twice? Then I shall sell it for 500,000. And ladies and gentlemen, please remain calm. The back of power will come on shortly. It's gone. <laughs> Move it! Get out of the way! Stop him! Hey, stop that guy! Fermo! What are you doing? You're letting him get away! You speak Spanish. What? Sam, tell me you got the cross. You got St. Dismas right here. You want to say hi? Yeah, we really kicked the hornet's nest down here. Ballroom's locked down, security's scrambling. Hey, Victor, where's our getaway? Come to the driveway out front. Just follow the spotlights. I'll bring the car around.
Guess you can't touch the ground.
climb and get a good vantage point. Merda. Se riescono a svegliarsela, non ce la faranno. Li troveremo e li riempiremo di buchi. Ma sappiamo cosa fare. Resta concentrato. D'accordo. On my way. Heading to higher ground to get my bearings. All right, see you soon. Yeah. There's the ballroom. Driveway's right in front. Okay. Everything's fine. No one got a good look at me. Just gonna play cool. Stroll right on out of here. You're not supposed to be back here. Well, neither are you. But I'll tell you what, I won't tell anyone if you don't. You have something I want, and you're going to give it to me. Really? Well, I'm flattered, but I'm afraid I'm spoken for. Oh, if you'll excuse me. I'm not in the mood for games. Give me the crucifix. Lady, you're lucky I'm a gentleman. Because if I weren't, I would... You'd what? <laughs> All right, fine. <clears throat> Just remember, I didn't want to do this. Let's see what you've got. Come on, Nathan Drake. <clears throat> Don't telegraph so much. I'm just trying to make it fair. That's not nice. Come here. Now hand me the artifact. Do you know how many artifacts I've collected over the years? You're gonna need to be more specific. Let me see if I can clarify! Alright, look. I'm still a little jet-lagged. How about we just call it here? Oh, son of a... Have you
you had enough? She kicked my butt. Do you want to keep being a smart ass? You know, you're breaking a lot of expensive stuff in here. If you're not careful, they're gonna kick us out of here. All right, wait, wait. It's in my back pocket. Where is it? Right there. <laughs> All right, I'm at the car. Where the hell are you guys? Uh, I just met your friend, Nadine Ross. She's lovely. Yeah, well, it's total chaos out here. They're trying to keep it contained, but everybody's freaking out. I don't want to rush you, but hurry the hell up. Nathan, where you at? Good question. You? By the ballroom. Look for this round sign thing. It's on the way. Round sign thing. Check. Good news is I got a gun. See you soon. <laughs> in there <laughs> I can't get to you from here you got a way down yeah yeah I think so okay I'll meet you at the driveway just head towards the ballroom all right see you there you spotted me kind of stuck here any ideas uh, fastest way is through the ballroom you said the ballroom's locked out yeah well now that they know it's you guys they cleared the place out that ballroom it is. You get that, Nathan? Yeah, got it.
Ma che... Puoi scappare! Okay, almost to the ballroom. Nathan, I'm pinned down in here. I can use a hand. On my way, Sam. Oh, good. Aspetta. Sì, ho trovato qualcosa. All right, here we go. <laughs> <laughs>
out of time here. Hold on, kid. Nearly there. Almost there. Unless you're driving a herd. You better hurry. I hope I don't go to hell for this. Oh, shit. What? It's empty. What? Oh, you're such an <laughs> asshole. He's your brother. All right. Skull and crossbones. Very good sign. It's Avery's insignia. What is this? Uh, Odie mecum eris. In paradise. Today you will join me in, in paradise. paradise. It's when Jesus said to Saint Dismas on the cross. Right. But what about these numbers here? What do, you, what do you make of this? It's some kind of code or a phone number. <laughs> Come on. The dates. Huh? Look. 1659. It's the year Avery was born. 1699. Let me guess. The year he died. Well, uh, by most accounts, yeah, but. It means we have date of birth, date of death, and paradise. Which means we're looking for Avery's grave. It's St. Dismas's Cathedral. <laughs> Wait a second. Hasn't Rafe been scouring that site for ages already? Yeah, the cathedral. See these symbols? Yeah. These are found on old Scottish gravestones. Right. Right? Now, look at this. The layout of this place is really unusual. Uh. Here's the cathedral, but the graveyard is way over here. Rafe's been focusing on the wrong area. Exactly. Guys, we're going to Scotland. All right, all right. Wait, wait up. You do realize that Rafe knows you're coming? Yeah, we can deal with that when we get there. Look, that psycho would like nothing better than for you to show up. Plus, he's got Nadine and her whole army to back him up. Yeah, but he doesn't have this. The biggest pirate treasure of all time is within our grasp. I thought this was about saving Sam. It is. Well, come on, it's both, right? We need the treasure so we can save Sam. How is Elena cool with all this? Oh, Jesus, kid. Look, it's just not that simple. 
With all that you two have been through together. She wouldn't understand this. You are not giving her enough credit. <sighs> I can't take that chance. <clears throat> Nathan, he's right. But things have changed. Rafe's involved now, and I can, I can take this on my own, really. Great. Well, thank you for your input, both of you. Excuse me. Hey. Hey, it's me, yeah. Now the reception's lousy. Yeah. Something on your mind, dear? Look, I, uh, I realize it couldn't have been easy all those years away. And I'm sorry for what happened to you. But it's not his fault. I never said that it was. It took a long time for him to get out of this game. You see a gun to his head? He chose this. Okay, he's meant for this life. You really believe that? Why are you here, Victor? Because somebody's got to keep an eye out for him. No, I'll just see you in a few more weeks. Yeah, I will. Okay. I love you, too. Bye. Just told her that the job was going to take a little longer than expected, which is the truth. Right? So come on, what do you say? Sam could still use our help. Well, <clears throat> I do hear that the weather is particularly fine in Scotland this time of year. Well, Rafe's really going all in, isn't he? Well, they're all concentrated around the cathedral, so that's good. Because we are going to have that graveyard all to ourselves. <sighs> Sully. Yeah? Hey, listen, we're good to go here. Okay, kid. Happy hunting. Last chance to come with. Yeah, well, unless you can find me an escalator, I think I'll pass. <laughs> all right, we'll see you in a few. Uh, hey, Nate. Yeah. Just, uh... Ah, uh, just bring me back something shiny, will you? That's the plan. Well, let's go pay our respects to Captain Avery, huh? Scottish Cathedral. Strange place to bury your treasure, no? Uh, not really. And by the time Avery would have sailed here, the place was already abandoned. I guess that's true. Plus, with the massive bounty on his head, it'd be a good place to hide. So, uh, what happened between you and Rafe? Nah, I couldn't deal with him. I'm pretty sure he'd had enough of me. I was still coming to grips with your uh, death and with his frustration from not finding the treasure. I'm pretty sure he was ready to kill me by the time I bailed. What do you want to do to you now? Yeah, <laughs> trying not to. <clears throat> Sam, listen. He's ruthless. I mean, even more so than when we teamed up with him. <clears throat> I mean, I've heard stories. Trust me, me too. All the more reason I don't feel bad about any of this. Long drop. Yeah. We need to find another way down. Hey, this should hold. Huh. Good call. <clears throat> the hell is all this? It's excavation equipment. Shoreline? Look, I thought they were just by the cathedral. Oh, okay, we're good. Yeah, nice to meet you too, Shoreline. 
Seems like they were expecting us. And like they're searching away from the cathedral. Which means we should get to that graveyard pronto. Exactly. Why didn't you guys search beyond the cathedral? Oh, we did, a little. This place is so big, without knowing where to look. Like shooting in the dark. Or like blowing shit up in the dark. What is this place? The monks had several living quarters. Main one being by the graveyard, of course. <laughs> yeah, location, location, location. More shoreline equipment. Uh, at least no shoreliners. Well, maybe we'll get lucky and they'll blow themselves up. Now, what do you bet? Yep. Dynamite. Yeah, be careful with that stuff, huh? Got the door open. That was very loud. Hopefully they didn't hear us. Uh, hopefully we just blend in with the other explosions. Look, there's a way up through the roof. That's too high for a boost, though. Well, let's find something to climb on. Yeah. Hey, we can use this to climb out of that building. There you go. Take that, door. You're pretty good with that stuff. Well, I've blown a lot of shit up over the years. No sign of it. Anything? Nothing. Do some recon. I'm checking here. Be careful.
clear so far. How about you? My side's clear. It might be this way. Yeah, okay. Nicely done. That could have been bad. Yeah. Let's get out of here before anyone checks in on them. There. Come on, let's go. <clears throat> Got it. Oh, careful. <clears throat> You can do that. What are you talking about? I taught you that move. All right, let's see it then. There. You see? That was clumsy. Sam, there's a ladder just out of reach. Hey, right, hold up. I'll come over. Give me a boost. Come here. I'll pull you up. Thanks. All right, there it is. A mug storm. Just a hop, skip, and a jump away. Ah, uh, 
Don't jinx us. Here we go. Burns a little. Well, those are fun. I could do this all day. Double to wipe them out. You go where the money leads you. That's cold. It gets colder. I'm gonna take a leak while you educate our young recruit you. So what happened next? Did you put down the revolt? With our help, he kept it at bay. Once money ran out, there's no reason for us to stick around anymore. And the general? Didn't even last a night. <laughs> Cold bastard. As Nadine says, business is business. Whatever gets us more action. I think it's a big coup right now. Tell me about it. <laughs> nice one. You get the left one. I got right. Gonna have to do better than that, fellas. Let's see if we can keep this up. Done prepping the site. The cemetery is ready for rich boys' visit. They're not slowing down, are they? The old lady wants the results. She wants them yesterday. Have they found anything? Heard they uncovered some stuff. Well, I don't know the details. Alright, that concludes part four. I'll pick up on this here in a minute.